A complete urinalysis is the window to your kidney health. It starts with proper collection and immediate processing. First, the physical exam. We check color and clarity. Pale yellow is normal, but red could mean blood, and dark amber might indicate liver issues. Next, the chemical exam. This reagent strip tests for pH, protein, glucose, ketones, and bilirubin in seconds. We compare the color changes against the control chart. High glucose, possible diabetes, high protein, potential kidney damage. To see the unseen, we centrifuge the sample to separate the solid sediment from the liquid for microscopic viewing. Under the microscope, these are red blood cells. Their presence, known as hematuria, suggests stones, trauma, or infection. These larger granular cells are white blood cells or pus cells. A high count here is a strong indicator of a urinary tract infection. Squamous epithelial cells. A few are normal, but too many usually indicate the sample was contaminated during collection. Casts are tube-shaped proteins formed inside the kidney tubules. Granular or cellular casts can pinpoint kidney disease specifically. Crystals come in many shapes. These envelope-shaped ones are calcium oxalate. They are the building blocks of kidney stones. Finally, we look for pathogens. Rod-shaped bacteria or budding yeast confirm the diagnosis of an infection requiring antibiotics. All these findings are combined into a final report, helping doctors diagnose everything from UTIs to diabetes. Follow for more medical insights.